Hello guys, welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I want us to talk about Laravel cookie consent package that is developed by Sparty and this package enables you to be able to be compliant with the European Union uh, cookie regulations whereby the user is supposed to be informed of whether they are being tracked with the cookies and they're supposed to give permission to that effect. So let us look at how we can be able to use this package. It is one of the packages that is uh, simple to use, even though most of other things which are not covered within this package, you are supposed to implement by yourself. So let us go ahead and see how to install. So the documentation will be found under Laravel cookie consent. If you search that in Google um, search, you will be able to get this as the first in the list and then you can be able to use it. So I will scroll uh, downwards until where we have the documentation where we can be able to install. And this is uh, the command that we will use to install. So I'm going to type it in here. Composer require Sparty Laravel cookie consent. I hit enter. Our package is fully installed and we can go ahead and publish the config file if we would like it uh, modified to our liking. So we can uh, just publish that. And after that, then we can go and check it out. So it is cookieconsent.php. And so what we have here is uh, that we have enabled the cookie consent. That is one of the, of the things. And then we have the cookie name, which is uh, Laravel consent. But of course, you can change the name if you want. And then the lifetime. So this one is uh, a duration in days. So 365 times 20. That seems to me like 20 years. And uh, that is what we have in the configuration file. After that, for us to be able now to load uh, this um, consent in our page we can go ahead to resources views and in the view that we want to uh, have this probably the splash page then we can be able to pass it in um, the, as the last thing in our in our body tag so let us go ahead and pass it in and we just include it so at include cookie consent cookie hyphen consent and then index like that so i would like to attempt and see if there's anything that is displayed in our page so we will refresh and then scroll to the bottom and we have um something that is being displayed but even though it is not being displayed well so let us see if it is um an issue of ensuring that we have um run npm run dev so let me run npm install we can then run npm run dev to compile the assets i would like to attempt and check again now it's formatted very nicely as you can see below here and so one can just click to allow the cookies or not so basically that is what you can be able to do but obviously according to what we have in the documentation because i've already accepted then I'm not able to show the other way in which we could be able to do it. You can either include the cookie consent using at include, or you can also just do it via middleware. So if you include this party cookie consent middleware, then you can be able to also have the same effect. But um, we will be satisfied by just one way in which we have been able to have. But of course, you can also be able to customize the text and even uh, localization by publishing the, the, the language uh, files. So in this case, if um, we go back to uh, that, we can be able to do the translation. So we have language above here. And as you can see, we have very many languages that are supported here. You have uh, very many of them, actually. And so what I want us to maybe look at is English, because that is the one that we are using. So 
basically um you will uh, add a message and um, a, another key that is called agree so agree is allow cookies and the other one is uh, the message which in this case this one reads your experience on this site will be improved by allowing cookies so just that and of course if they do not want to allow they will not click on that button and it's fine so basically that is how you can be able to in a quick way uh, implement um, this feature which we, you make you compliant to the European Union laws Thank you very much for following this video tutorial up until this point. If you like the video, please give it a like, a thumbs up. And if you are new to this channel, please consider giving a subscription. If you have a comment, you can shoot in the comment section below. Thank you very much.